Well, ladies and gentlemen, Chuck finished the play Spyro up uh, Sp Sonic the Hedgehog Part Five. We are now in the fifth zone, Starlight Speedway, I believe is what it was called. I didn't catch the name of it. I uh, be damned if I could remember the name of it. But this, this is uh, the some of the quick the quicker zones we've seen in a while. But it is uh, very difficult and got a lot of different paths that you can take. And not all that easy to go after the emeralds here. As you can see, there is a green and gold orbanaut that doesn't shoot the balls at us, so that makes him indestructible. The bombs will shoot, uh, as you saw, the blast radius does, damn it, go pretty far. That probably just screwed me over there with uh, not being able to get the emerald. Should be going after more of these rings, but I don't really think I'm gonna. I believe there is one section here where I can go after all of the uh, go after all of the rings, or go after a huge. There's like a, a walkway with at least four ring boxes. Careful while jumping around here. It's pretty there's a, there, a lot of holes here that you can easily fall down into let's see just loop back around and hope beyond hope that I can because this is pretty much the last time that I will be able to go after the see is that it up there well that is one ring box but if this looks like it's gonna be the end I can what the hell? Oh. So I can just go after the... No? Do not tell me I cannot go over there. Because I'm, I'm right there, I'm right here at the end, so I gotta have to... And of course I can't jump back down there. I want to be able to get the... I only need two more rings. So let's see, where are the other rings at? I should have went after more the rings that were around these loops. Let's see where... Jump down here. And go after what I need. Nope! Damn it. Knew that was going to probably fucking happen. Come on now. And there's really no checkpoints here, it's just they're, the level is so short that you really don't need uh, to have a checkpoint, and since you start it right at the beginning, anyway, you'll have a life there, which isn't very hard at all to get to. Again, we'll jump down here, but we'll make sure we go after all of the... He doesn't seem to lose any speed while running backwards. Interesting. Uh, but... We'll make sure we don't lose any rings. And if we do, we'll just go after every ring we can. Because we, as I've, I've, as I've noticed, now that we can make it, it's not missed the fire. Whew. I'm actually surprised that I missed that fire. But now I'm pretty much at the point, if I do lose any rings here, that I'm not going to be able to make it. So we'll just do, do the best we can. While running through here, see what's down. Just trying to take it easy. Make sure there ain't no fire that's gonna hit us, or any other uh, bombs or anything that will screw us up. You can just uh, sit on that and let it let it go up as you just saw. And we'll run back up around here. As you can see, I'm taking it a lot more cautiously than I did before. Uh, it's because I don't remember where all of the... where everything is. And... Nope, gotta go up here. And then... Hit that, I can use that as a... What the hell? 
down here. Come on. Do not tell me you're not gonna come down here. <sighs> yeah. This is stressful as hell. Alright, so that should right be right at the end. Haha. -ha. So there we go. Not too long, about 2.30. Uh, but this is the last emerald we'll need. As I've said many, many times. And I'll save it here. Since I, I know that it's very easy to die. Trying to go after the... Go after this emerald. Especially as much as you fall and everything. So you just pretty much just sit sit on it if you can. Uh, like most of them, most of the diamonds or squares, whatever those are, that are blocking it, just try to get up to it. This is a little bit easier to sit on rather than some of the ladder ones that we did. And there we go. Sonic got them all. So now I'll be able to show you. See all the uh, gray, green, blue, orange, red, and purple, I believe is what the, all those colors were. Get these rings. I do like the, uh, what they did with this level. You can see the close-up, uh, pillars. And there, and the stars in the background, and this is really a, uh, well-designed level. I like it a lot, and I like how short it is. And it, uh, especially if you stay up top, the higher you stay, the quicker this level will go. It'll go a lot quicker. And the music ain't too bad, either. But this one... Oh. That's odd. Okay, no, whoa. Okay, there we go. Yeah, you gotta be careful of those springs. They will get you. Especially if they, uh... Can't at all send you into something. They will hurt you. They they will more often than not. All right. So this is uses a cease uh not a seesaw effect, but uh, what you just all you need to do is just jump on one end, let the uh, let the spiked ball jump uh, land on the other side, and it will propel you up. You can do that twice to get to your highest to the very height of the jump. And so I guess Act 2 would be the easier one to go after, but there you go. See, the boss for Act 3 is going to be fairly difficult. And, uh, let's see where we are here. Uh, oh! You can hit those, uh, Orbanauts if you are flashing, so, yeah, you know it won't, uh, whoa, be very careful about that fire. You wanna make sure you jump on the other side of it rather than in the middle, like that, just for the, so you can get to the highest point of your jump. There we go, okay. You gotta be careful of those bombs. Crap. There we go, that should send it up higher. Damn it. Nope. Come on. That should send me up high enough that I can get up here, yeah. Alright, so there should be a, another a hall with a bunch of those bombs. I'm not sure if, I, if I'm too low or, or what, but should be up around here somewhere. It's usually best just to stay up uh, up high for, because of the speed and you'll get a lot more rings and it's a lot safer. Ah, there we go. That's one of the many halls with the bombs. Have to run back here real quick. Just you, you do run faster. I haven't uh, said this yet, but you do run faster if you don't hold the right uh, the right button. 
or whichever direction you're running in, you will run faster if you just let Sonic run himself, uh, rather than holding the button down. While you will need that to keep the momentum going, you know, if you're going really slow, but on some of these sections in this level is really is really where you can see that effect happening. Uh, no, yep. Very careful through there. Again, those springs will, if they can at all, throw you into something that will hurt you. They will gladly. All right, so this is the boss. What we can do here is we gotta we can either launch Sonic up and hit him and hit him, or launch one of these spiked balls up to hurt him. Two different ways to do it. It's not too hard. You can actually you can also stay in the middle of one of these right, right here and wait for him to come lower and hit him but this is just a lot easier to do just wait for just kind of just stay in the middle one and wait for him to drop it or do that if you can it's a lot harder to do the middle one is usually the easiest but thank you for watching the challenge of the video is how many of those bombs blew up in the entire uh in each of the acts thanks for watching until next time